Who is Randy? Don't bring anyone mother into this. Your mom in the fucking sand. One morning after I quit, I didn't buy the plane until very late on in, in late night, and then I still had it afterwards, and I was getting worried about how much money I had to earn every year just to not go broke. Yeah. And I thought, I, I think I have to scale it down a little bit. And then my wife, who we've talked about before, said, maybe it's time to end the baller lifestyle. You're not a fucking rapper. <laughs> and so I, so I. They're I all said, the same, aren't they? Ah, dream crusher. What about jewelry as an investment? My husband's fond of buying very expensive gold chains. Did I, you do any I'm, of that? I'm, I'm, I have to tell you, I yeah. am so hooked up in the jewelry market. You are? I am not saying it on the air with you guys, but afterwards, we can go to a place. Okay, okay. Yeah. Now, hey. listen, you can't show anyone you have it once you get it. No, 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 no. All right, okay, okay. cool. Yeah. I How mean, much should he spend on it? I don't care who had to die to get this. Okay, okay. well, then that's good. 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 Now, do you wear gold chains? Sometimes. Are you, do you rap at any point? Cause no. I, no. I don't know, the rapping king? I'm just, I mean, I'm spitball. I mean, yeah, ball. it's a good idea. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a new act. Yeah. I need a new hour. Do you need a new hour? Have you just dumped another on yeah, Netflix? Is, yeah, that, is it just, Netflix? Is that yeah, your... yeah, I shot one. I haven't, it hasn't come out yet. But then, you know, you start to get that panic. You're like, oh, fuck. Yeah, because mm. when you don't have an act, you think. Yeah. But here's the thing, though. I, I'm done. What? You're done? Mm, I'm not going to do it anymore. Really? Yep, that's it. After this? This one's out. This that's is it. it. That's it. I'm and not you, write Did you one. know that as you were doing it? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. I think, ah, enough. What's going on? You had nothing to say? You, you oh, yeah, I think that's it. I think I yeah. said everything I had to say. And, and then I thought, do I really want to be a 57-year-old man commenting on the lives of people 25 years younger than me? Because that's where you end up. And I think, no, I don't want to be that guy. So I've, I've got some books and some stories that I want to write. And, I, and I'm directing a movie next year. And oh. I'm going to do that. Oh. Okay. Well, you're doing a lot of things. Yeah. yeah, I'm doing things. I'm just not doing any more stand-up. I, I could know. see. I mean, no. I always have this that thought in my head of like, what would be like? Do you you know you you play in your head? Will I be the guy who's still gigging in his seventies? Yeah, you know what I mean, like doing those, or or do you go? Will I do this and then something else will become of interest and I'll just because you also see like if you're a comic, you see so many people who are successful comics that end up stepping away. Well, you know? I think I think there's probably. Uh, there's probably a reason for it. I think that if you keep going in the same vein, <clears throat> like when I started doing doing stand up, I, I was like, it was the time of punk rock, really, or just after punk rock, and it, it was very angry type of style and a very kind of aggressive yeah. and booze ridden environment, and you know, and I had a very angry sort of persona and I used to run around and be very physical and stuff. And I think if you do that in your fifties, people kind of like feel sad for you yes yeah. you like, know you're right like <clears throat> i i love madonna i follow her <laughs> it's, it's exactly that right? it's exactly right <gasps> <gasps> yeah. but oh, i mean man. i follow her on the gram and and i'm not sure i can't put my finger on what is not right like she's she's gigging hard she's doing the show and she has a lot of surgeries and she wants to look exactly as she did in her 20s and i like, I, am I a misogynist? Because, uh, you know what I mean? Am I like, no, I so. why are you trying to look young, bitch, when Mick Jagger's out there doing his thing still? Oh, people feel sad for Mick Jagger. <laughs> <It's> like, <laughs> they fucking sure do. Do they? It's like, I, do you know why I worked with him for a while? You did? What? Yeah, yeah, yeah. When? Years ago, I wrote a movie called Saving Grace. And the movie did really well. It won a Sundance and all that. Just like, run about 1999, 2000. And he saw it. And he had an idea for a movie, and he wanted me to write the screenplay for it. So I went on tour with the Rolling Stones for a little bit. Come what? on. Bridges to Babylon tour, yeah. And? and when when Mick had time, he would sit and give me notes on the script and stuff like that. And how long did you, I mean, how long did you do that for? About a couple of months. Okay. I mean, it's quite an experience, right? really good at doing Mick. Yeah. <laughs> like, you know, I, I can do his voice yeah. in ways where only when he's sitting down now. Yeah. Like, and he always likes to tell people where to sit, like, you know what, Christine? You should probably sit there. Really? And Tom sit there would be better. Better really? for him. He yeah, wants yeah. the room arranged. He likes to arrange it. Yeah, yeah. He's, he's not a bad guy at all. He's a very yeah. nice man. Well, according to Keith Richards, Keith hates the guy. Well, Keith Richards is a very impressive dude, though. Because he Keith Richards obviously was around. I didn't interact with him much, but it's very uh, much his band. Everybody kind of is in awe of Keith Richards. Because Keith Richards... It would be in that band if they were playing in a pub in South London for 
25 quid a night. He doesn't care about whether it's a pub or a stadium. He just loves playing the music. It's really about the music for him. Mm -hmm. And he's a rare beast like that. I mean, mm. he's very, very pure. And this, the idea that he's a kind of out of control, you know, druggy is kind of... Not true? I, I think it's a little exaggerated. I think right. he's enjoyed heroin, but who amongst who us hasn't? hasn't? Yeah. Yeah. I've, I've certainly enjoyed heroin. <laughs> I, I have to say, um, <laughs> the uh, I took heroin uh, more informally yeah. uh, in the 1980s. And then... When, it's got to be great. It's, it's got to be, be the great. best. Well, I have to... Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah it's good. But I had dental surgery about two years ago. And it was a very intense, inflamed abscess thing. It was very, very painful. And they gave me some of that new heroin. That yeah. They the oxy. The oxy. Yeah. Uh, it was a Percocet, oh. it was called. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. Those are great. Sweet Jesus. Yeah, is that what heroin feels like? Percocet? Heroin isn't as good as Percocet. Really? really? Yeah, no, I don't think so. I, mean, I was going to say, like, if, wow. if you're starting drugs now, you got to get into pills. You gotta yeah. try pills. You gotta <laughs> yeah, I love it. that you guys are doing a you know PSA yeah. as yeah. well as a podcast. That's where you want to lean into. That's where you fuck needles, snorting. Yeah. Oh no! Listen, if I was going to get off the wagon and start doing drugs and alcohol, yeah. again, I don't think I'd be drawn into alcohol much because that that makes, makes you fat, hungover. Yeah, but if angry. I was getting into anything, I think it would be. And I've seen people with long time sobriety fuck their lives up with Vicodin. Yep. Sure, it's uh, easy yeah. to get, yeah. I especially mean, if you're a celebrity. And all, yeah, I yeah. mean, exactly. Yeah. I was, hey, I used to be on late night. Yeah. Extra yeah. 50 in the bag. Yeah. 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 Can I get some perks? Doctor? Now, yeah. let's talk about heroin. When's the first time you did it? In, uh, in New York in uh, 1984. And how do you, how does one do heroin for the well, first time? Well, they used to have a thing that was called chasing the dragon. I don't like the yeah. idea of needles. So you know chasing the dragon, yeah. right? You set fire to underneath the uh, silver paper and inhale the, oh, the smoke. I think I did that accidentally when you I was 15. Also, you can also snort it. You can snort heroin. I Is that smoked you heroin it? accidentally. Yeah, you, you snorted heroin? Yeah. I can't remember if I, I've certainly snorted many things. Yeah. Heroin may, may have yeah. been part of it. <laughs> But you injected it. Did Never injected. No, I, oh. I, I'm i very glad of that, actually. I, yeah, me as too. As it turned out, there was a horrible... I don't know if you guys heard, <laughs> but there was a horrible disease connected to yes. this. Oh, boy. <laughs> but by the, I don't know what it says about me that um, I keep... like I feel yeah. at peace yeah. with your decision. Just like It calmed me down that you're like, I think I'm done doing stand-up. I'm like... <sighs> Why? I, yeah, I just showed you the door good. at the it, end of yeah, it. Yeah, it feels good to hear. I don't know or why. that someone else can. Yes, I, yeah, you can. I, yeah. I think it feels like once you start and you're hooked, because stand-up really is the only thing in my life I've ever really committed and, and stuck with. It It, it yeah. made me an adult. It made me a better person, right. the discipline of it. Obviously, marriage and children, yes, too. But, sure. Um, but I can't give up. I can't stop. Yeah. No, There's I, a it's thing time. that you can't. It's not time, time to, but it, yeah. it, it, huh. it's something about hearing somebody who's further ahead than you than go like, and then I... Reach this point, and now I'm just done, and I'm going to do something else. I'm like, that, that's nice. I, I equate it a back? little bit like uh, boxers. You know, yes. really good boxers. Exactly. If you know when to quit, you can have a good life afterwards. If you don't know when to quit, you, you're going to get hurt and start talking yeah, weird. But you know yeah. what? You're a very introspective, smart, thoughtful person. Yeah, I think you might not be You're going to come back. Once you go to Scotland, you're going to kick around with these cows, and you're going to get bored, and that rebel's going to come up i don't think so i mean i i i appreciate the idea of that and i thank you for it but i don't think that's true right, right? i don't need it i used to need it yeah i used to really the need whole... it. i mean the, all the things you you describe it did that for me too yeah and i made my family money and it gave me money to put my kids in at decent schools and, and have a nice place to live and a plane and stuff and it it, it did stuff for me but i don't want to i don't to be honest, I don't want to take advantage of it, if you know what I mean. Really? Like, I, I'm, I'm done. You're done. Wow. Um, All right. And, you know, look, smash cut to 18 months later. It's my new special, guys. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I don't think so. I don't think so. I think there's other things to do. Also, I've, you know, like I said, I'm 57 years old. The only non-negotiable commodity is time. Yes. And in the best, best scenarios, mine is running out. You know, so... Uh, you got to do what you got to do. But you want to do, but you are, you're passionate about these other things that you're doing. Though. I'm passionate about a lot. I'm yeah. passionate actually uh, uh, about, you know, the idea of stand up as an art form. I just don't think I would want to make any more of it. Yeah, yeah. You know, but, but when I see it done well, I'll it's still exciting. love yeah. it still and great. still appreciate it. Um, I just don't think it's, 
I think it's somebody else's turn. Now. I got you. I um, got you. Hi, Jeans. Did you like that highlight? Well, you can watch an entire episode here or more highlights here. But definitely, definitely subscribe here. That way you can, you know, get the latest videos as they drop. For real, four strokes. <laughs>